Hi, my name is Laura St. Pierre, and I'm a product manager for the IQ SensorNet system. The IQ SensorNet system is a network of probes and analyzers designed to help monitor and control the wastewater process. It can be used on the rail or in a control house and can be networked throughout the plant from the influent to the effluent. I would like to talk to you specifically about the Varium probe. The Varium probe is designed to measure ammonium and nitrate with ion selective electrodes. It can be used to help monitor and control the nitrification and denitrification process within your wastewater treatment plant as well as help control aeration. It's very accurate. It's accurate to plus or minus 5% or 0.2 milligrams per liter in solution. As you can see, there are four ports on the face of the Varium probe. Two of the electrodes are measuring electrodes, ammonium and nitrate. This third port can be used for a compensating electrode. You can install a potassium electrode to help compensate the ammonium reading or the chloride probe to help compensate the nitrate reading. The fourth port is for the reference electrode. We have an ISE installation tool that can be used to help uninstall the probes as well. I'm going to go ahead and remove the reference so you can take a look at it. As you can see, all probes are individually replaceable, so you only have to replace what's needed without having to replace the whole set. Looking at the reference electrode, you can see that our reservoir is quite large. This really helps improve the stability and accuracy of our ion selective electrode measurement, as well as increase the lifetime of the probes. Another thing we do to increase the lifetime of the probes is we put a metal grid over the membrane to protect the membrane of the ion selective electrode. This allows us to warranty the electrodes for 12 months and with a usable life of about 18 to 24 months. Once all the electrodes are installed, the probe automatically rec recognizes them due to the contacts on the electrodes. When you're ready to attach it, you can see that all IQ SensorNet probes are detachable from the system, from the cable, helping with handling and making handling easier. It is a digital system and digitally recognizes the probes automatically when they are attached. So I'll go ahead and attach the Varian. And after about a minute, the 2020 will show the nitrate and ammonium measurements. Once you install the electrode and the Varian probe in your wastewater process, it's always a good idea to perform a matrix adjustment. I recommend that you install the probe in the process for about 30 minutes before performing a matrix adjustment. All you have to do is take a grab sample from near the probe, tell the 2020 you're doing a matrix adjustment, and it will pause its readings in time. At that point, do a laboratory analysis for nitrate, ammonium, and your compensating electrode. Come back to the system when you can, when you have time, and input, that values, input those values into the system. By performing a matrix adjustment, we can compensate for any other free ions that might be in the process that we're not already compensating for. To maintain accurate readings, you might also want to employ air cleaning. We have an air cleaning system that can be attached to the face of the probe, or periodic maintenance of just pulling the probe out of the process and wiping it with some water and a toothbrush to keep the electrodes clean.